one. Um, it's Keenan. Um, so I'm gonna make my video in front of our Christmas tree. Um, yes, it's quite nice. I'll show a bit more of it. Uh, yeah. Okay. So that's basically our Christmas tree. Okay. So I'm gonna be talking about the holidays, or as some people has have been referring to, um, the holidays. So what are the holidays like for you? So okay. First of all. I celebrate Christmas, as you can tell. Um, I'm also half Jewish, so we kind of... I don't really celebrate Hanukkah, because my dad, who was raised Jewish, isn't very religious at all. Um, my mom is raised Catholic, and my dad is, um, you know, Jesus fan and stuff, I guess. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, I guess you can consider us Christians. But um, we kind of do the Hanukkah stuff, and I identify with the Jewish part of my family as well. Um, so we do a little bit of Hanukkah stuff. We have menorahs. Um, Festivus, I think, would be cool. To do. What are the holidays like for you? So, and then, um, do you spend them with relatives or chosen family? So I spend holidays with both. Um, on Christmas Eve, we usually have a go to a party um, with all of our like family, friends, and everything. And then usually on Christmas Day, it's usually me and my parents, and then um, sometimes my grandma's over, or, or my aunt. Um, so yeah. So this year, my grandma and my aunt are going to be here at my house. Um, and so, uh, the next question is, do they know about your genderqueer identity? Um, I haven't used the term genderqueer to them. Um, because that would be really complicated. Um, uh, but I'm out to, as trans to them. Um, my aunt was actually the first relative I came out to. Um, I first came out to her back, uh, in eighth grade, and I actually told her I was a lesbian. And that, she's the only person, uh, she's the first and last person I came out to a lesbian, as a lesbian to. Um. Before that, I had never, whenever, when I came out to my friend, some of my friends, um, I just said that I liked girls, um, and then after that, I came out as genderqueer and liking girls and then as trans, um, so, I, uh, I, yeah, I never really identified with the word genderqueer, or, I'm sorry, <laughs> yes I did, um, I never really identified with the term lesbian, um, uh, but, I, I figured at that point when I came out to her I, that was the only that was the only way um, so yeah um, but I came out to her this summer as you know changing my name and everything and that was tough for her I think um, because now she has three nephews um, and no nieces um, I mean I was never like I was never the kind of like her at all. I mean, she's she's a straight cisgendered woman, and she's very straight and very cisgendered. Um, I mean, she definitely likes men, and she she loves being a woman. She, we were talking about this, and she loves being a woman, and I, I don't, I can't understand that, and she can't understand, like, not identifying with how you were born, and I can't really identify with, identifying with what you were, how you were born. So, um, but she's having, I think, a harder time with it. I think, I think there might have been a little bit of hope there that I would, uh, I would change or something. But, um, I mean, she's overall accepting. It's definitely going to take her time to get used to the pronouns and the name, especially because we don't, um, we only see each other about once a year, if. Um, and I think, I mean, she's accepting, I guess, um, but it's going to take her time to come around and, just explaining to her how I feel and everything. Um, so we'll see how that goes. And then my grandmother, who's coming to visit, um, I came out to her, I don't know, a bit ago about liking girls, and she was like, yeah, I figured. Um, but she still, she's like, but you never know, someday you might meet a nice young boy. And I was like, yeah, no, like that's not gonna happen. I mean, I didn't go on my whole, like, well, sexuality is fluid and stuff, but really, I, I don't imagine myself being attracted to a guy. It could change. Or someone you would stereotypically think of as male. Um, so, yeah. 
uh, no. But then when it came out to her, um, she basically was like, you're too young to know, I have this psychiatrist friend who, like, says that, like, kids change their mind and blah, blah, blah. I'm like, yeah, your friend's, what, like, 80? Like, your friend hasn't been in practice for, like, 20 years, and, like, they might not even have any experience with people with, uh, different gender identities, and so, like, you're, I'm in therapy, my therapist, like, you know, agrees that I identify as transgender, they're not like, well, no, um, so I was just basically like, be quiet, like, I, I didn't say that, but like, your, your friend doesn't really know what she's talking about, um, and she's really old school and stuff, so that will be interesting, um, She's a devout Catholic, so that probably has to do a lot with it, too. Um, but, yeah, and then with my chosen family, um, some of them are great with the name pronouns. I mean, they're all accepting and fine with it. It's just going to take them time getting used to the whole trans thing and the whole name and pronouns and stuff. Um, I mean, some of them are great because two of my really good family friends... Um, they have a really good friend who's also a trans guy who's recently, um, uh, maybe within the last two years, actually, um, has come out and everything, and they've been friends with him since they were in, like, sixth grade. Uh, so they're really awesome with everything. Um, I'm, yeah, it's, I'm really happy about it. Um, and then everyone else, I think, is going to take time for the name and pronouns. They're a bit flippy, floppy on them. Um, but they're all cool with it. So, yeah, this Christmas will be inter interesting, being, like, my first Christmas as Keenan and everything. Um, what's my favorite holiday dish? Um, that's really difficult. I love turkey. I love cranberry sauce. I love stuffing. I love... We don't eat ham. Um, chocolate cake. Everything, actually. I do not like gravy. You no, not gravy. But basically, I really like everything else. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, I'm gonna do the other topic, too. But I'm gonna do it on a different video. Um, okay, bye.